Hey guys, Shardix here. So, I know it's been a while since I've uploaded Warframe content, but there's a reason for that, and I'm gonna explain it in this video. Now first of all, I can't stress this enough, but I do not hate Warframe. I love the game, it's my favorite game of all time, and DE, aka Digital Extremes, is a great company, but lately I've been losing interest in the game, and I'm only making this video because I care about the game, and I care about the people who watch me play the game, aka you guys. So as you can see from the title, Warframe is starting to get a little boring for me. This is going to be split into two parts. One, general content, which is like you YouTube content and just playing the game. And two, Nightwave content. Since, you know, that's what I upload all the time, what a street. So for general content, this mainly falls on the platform that I play on. As you may know, I play Warframe on PS4. And I really want to switch to PC, but I refuse to start from scratch. So why is the game game boring for me? Well, as you may know, Demos Arcana released on PC a few weeks ago. The console still doesn't have it. And by the way, as I'm recording this voiceover, they just announced that Demos Arcana is in cert. Still no release date, but it's coming soon. But this is because DE using the DE uses the PC version to test out bugs and stuff. So that when consoles get the update, we get the more polished version of it. And like I said, console has to go through a certification process for Sony, Microsoft, and Nintendo, see if the update is safe to deploy or not. And then after that, DE will give us a release date. But this is a problem because it leaves console players the old version, while PC players are having all the fun recording videos on the new stuff or just playing it in general. This also sucks for content creation because when the update finally comes out on console, all the people who play on PC, they already uploaded videos on everything, which makes console videos insignificant because you're so late to the party. Even if the console player covers the topic better than some PC player, because they're so late to the topic, no one really cares, doesn't matter. But there is an easy fix to it though, either bring back account migration or release cross save. They've never done console to PC migration, so it would be good to release it, especially since PC is becoming more prevalent than consoles and since PE is ahead all the freaking time. But cross save is on DE's bucket list, which if you don't know what that means, basically your account can be put on different devices like how Fortnite has it where if you have your Epic account linked to your PlayStation account, but you use that same Epic account on PC, whatever you do on PlayStation also happens on your PC account, and whatever you do on PC happens on your PlayStation account. But like I said, it's on the bucket list, but they haven't given any new news about it. Like they say they want, they say they really want to release this, but they're not giving any progress updates. So it's kind of useless right now. So I'm stuck on console, just waiting for Deimos Arcana, and I'm getting really bored of it. I literally log on to Warframe just to claim my daily tribute, and then I just get off. I don't usually do that. You could argue that I could try to rank stuff up or something, which I could do that soon because Banshee and uh, Mirage are about to get unvaulted so I could rank up the Euphona, the Agbolto, and the Kogake. But I'm at the point of the game where every master rank after 18 is pretty useless. As you may know, I'm mastering 26 currently and I've already completed the star chart, steel path and all. Completed every single quest, so there's really nothing to do. I'm starting to see why new players quit the game though. But it's different for them. They say that there's nothing to do when in reality, they could be finishing their star chart, finishing quests, or even upgrading their gear to do more advanced activities, like the Steel Path, Sanctuary Onslaught, or whatever else is out there. Once you get to the point of the game that I reached, then you can say that there's nothing to do, because it's mostly true at that point. But anyway, that's not the point of this. The point is that there's nothing really to do. So I haven't really tried to play the game too much, I've been playing more Geometry Dash and Fortnite, especially as you can see by my channel, I've been uploading way too much Geometry Dash, that's because it's easy content. I beat demons a lot, cause, you know, I'm getting better at PC, like I'm trying to get better, so I have to do this, and if I want to bring Geometry Dash back to the channel, why don't I just post my progress, you know? The only thing that's keeping me into the game is Nightwave, which is what I'm going to talk about right now. So you may have realized that I didn't stream Nightwave today, which today is December 6th at the time that I wrote the script for this video, but there's a good reason why. Basically, if you've been keeping up with my streams, you'll know that I'm about to hit the new cap, tier 120. So that means I'd end up quitting Nightwave streams soon anyway, unless they increase the cap again. 
but this time I really wouldn't care. Also, I needed to focus on homework and housework that day, so there's that as well. But anyway, now it was starting to become boring to me. Every tier is just 15 creds, nothing else. The, shop, the shops are always trash, they don't release the Goss Mag Helmet, and the mods and weapons are useless since I already own them. We won't be getting any new episodes, but that's not even the worst thing. We literally have an entire month left in Nightwing. Series 3 doesn't end until around mid-January. I can't continue to make stupid Nightwing streams during that. I even started to lose viewers during the streams. I don't know if it's because some people can't make it to the stream or if they're starting to get bored of Nightwave, but either way, my viewer count is starting to decrease more and more, and it's starting to get demotivating and annoying. I feel like DE should give Nightwave more significance, like maybe on your profile shows what prestige level you're at, or give us like a cool reward for reaching the cap or something, I don't know. Not just 15 creds and then nothing past tier 120, that's boring. So what does this mean for my Nightwave streams? Well, I'm gonna stop doing them until Intermission 3 comes out. I know that's a long time, that's an entire month, but I'm already about to reach the cap soon. I'm literally 5 tiers away from it. Is it really gonna hurt? Once Intermission 3 comes out, I'm gonna start grinding on Nightwave again, but things are gonna change. Once I reach tier 30, I'm gonna stop doing streams because it's gonna be pretty boring just getting the same reward over and over until I hit the cap. This way, if Nightwave gets extended again, it won't matter because I'm not wasting three and a half hours of my Sunday doing Nightwave. This doesn't mean that I'm quitting streaming though. Winter break is coming soon, so that means I'll be able to have more time to stream and stuff. So since I won't be streaming Nightwave, I could stream Geometry Dash Lover Request for example, instead of Nightwave. The Lover Request stream that I recently did, it went very well, and I enjoyed making it, so I really want to do more. I won't be streaming every Sunday, but I want to stream at least a few times. I'm glad that I'll be able to free up my Sunday though, since I'll be able to dedicate more time to homework and whatever else I want to do. But anyway, in this video I just wanted to talk about how Warframe is starting to become boring for me. If you still play it, I hope you're enjoying the game. Like I said, I do not hate the game, I don't hate people who play the game, and I'm not quitting the game either. But I had to make this video because I'm not really putting out too much Warframe content and I'm barely playing the game as well and I care about the game a lot I just wish there was more I just wish there was something else to do in Warframe right now but anyway I own it off here I might stream Deimos Arcana depends on what day it comes out so stay tuned but don't completely rely on it but anyway I'll see you guys in the next video peace out guys